We're back! This time in Sanya, also known as the Hawaii of China, and this time we return to the beach destination of Hainan to see what new attractions it has to offer. I'm Sonia and this is Travel SSBD. We are back! It's like we're celebrating our one year anniversary by coming back to Hainan and my Chinese has improved. Woman Chong Yu Hui Lai Le. That's all I can say. We are gonna go on an adventure. What else is new here in Hainan? I'm not really sure. But where are we going now? No one's going to tell me where we're going. So we travelled a bit differently this time. This is my um, first time taking a train in China. We're going to take the train to Sanya this time instead of driving. So we'll see how it goes. And it was really fast. It took us just a little bit over an hour to get here. But there was one embarrassing moment. Like I got kicked out of my seat by an auntie because I sat in the wrong seat. Check your ticket properly. And here's my clue. I haven't touched a clue in such a long time. This feels so good. This is actual water. How do you transport this here? There's a whale in the water. Da, 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 da. Under the sea. Like the little mermaid song. Under the sea. Under the sea. Are we going diving again? I didn't bring my diving suit. Let's go, let's go find out. So I didn't expect to come here. I didn't even know that this place existed. But it does. Okay, so we have arrived at what seems to be a really beautiful hotel. The clue was a little whale. Are we going to have a whale of a time? We'll find out now. So the moment we got into Atlantis Sanya, I was like, wow. I felt like I was immersed in the world of Aquaman because you would know that Atlantis is Aquaman's home place, right? So I'm about to check out the room that I'm going to stay in and I hear that it's the Neptune underwater suite. Let's go. Oh man, it is huge! Guys! Wait, where's the bed? Downstairs? Oh, downstairs, it is downstairs. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my god, guys! Dude, this is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. <gasps> Look at this here! This you missed it! You missed it! You missed it! Every single one of them is gonna have a name. Oh my god, oh my god, it's amazing. Welcome to my apartment for two nights. <laughs> Look at this beautiful view! You can actually see food! That's bad. I'm sorry, that was a bad joke. I mean, I should not be thinking of food when I look into this beautiful aquarium. It's, you know, a place where it's their haven and I'm here just to admire them and not think of sambal stingray. I swear, I swear. But more importantly, what is, what is this? I was meaning to ask, what is this creature on my bed? That's all I want to know. <laughs> it's kind of creepy though if they're going to watch you when I sleep at night. So the moment I entered the theme park, I realised that, hey, it's free entry for the resort guests. And we actually decided to go straight in for the most threatening looking ride. It's called the Leap of Face. It's like almost a 90 degree slide that goes down and it goes through a really majestic looking area. I'm really gonna regret this for sure. Ready? Okay. I was engulfed in water, which uh, my producer failed to mention to me. He said, it's fine, it's fine. Just go as you are right now. And look what happened. My entire face is in the water right now. <sighs> okay, after taking a literal leap of face and practically taking a shower earlier on, I hear that we're going for dinner, but first we got something else, which I will figure out now. Oh, there's no like other thing except the scroll. Whoever typed this knot, uh, it's very naughty. Uh. It's so difficult to take out! To market, to market, to market, to... Is this my shopping basket? So my first thought was, okay, maybe it's a night market. Close enough, but it was a whole new different experience. We are going to fish for our own food, right? I knew it! Are we really? We're going in? Is anything going to fit in this basket? That's my question. So, what should I make my crew eat today? <laughs> you shop for your seafood, which is live. Oh my god, I, can't, I have a problem with seeing my food alive like before. They might get a bit squeamish because I definitely did. Oh my god, it's a lobster. Oh my god, I can't, I can't, I can't, I can't. But it assures you 100% freshness. Okay, I'm clearly a city girl here, okay? Everyone's laughing at me. Okay, this is as fresh as it gets. I'm just glad that it's not moving around anymore. So the next step is deciding which restaurant to go to to cook these freshly caught seafood. Let's go. And you can select any restaurant you want to go to around that area. So you like spicy, you can go to this one. If they do fish better in this place, go to that one. I cannot read a single thing on this menu. <laughs> Please help me out. 
I'm only going to take the ones with the pictures. Everyone seemed like they had a great time and there's all kinds of seafood there as well. I've literally gained 2 kg from the dinner just now but aside from the place that we just ate at, everywhere else along this street you can actually enjoy a meal even if it's just the two of you. This place which is um, also known as Happiness Restaurant so you better bring your girlfriend here or your wife and you'll definitely leave a happy couple. All the restaurants here are super delicious. Good morning! This is my morning dance. I slept so well and I'm just waiting for my clue. I already know that it's there at the corner of my eye. Okay, let's see. Earplugs? Are you trying to shield me from myself? Because that's not gonna work. People say I'm a small person with a loud voice. It's not true, right? I'm a classy lady. Plug in. This is a really difficult clue. Um, I, I think I'm just gonna put on the earplugs. So I noticed that we're at the same hotel that we stayed in the last time. It is 100% deja vu moment, okay? So has this got anything to do with the clue? What is it? What are we doing? No! We were going on a helicopter ride! <laughs> so it's really, really exciting. I've been on helicopter rides before, yes, but this is different. You really get a bird's eye view of the entire Sanya Island. It also helped that you know, my uh, pilot was kind of cute, so... Yeah, it's a view like you would never ever get to see. Literally, you see almost every resort and the ocean is so clean, so blue, so beautiful. You get to fly over that as well. And it was just gorgeous. So our very next destination was the beautiful Rosewood Sanya. It is very minimalistic but classy with lots of beautiful art decor and stuff like that as well. That was our lunch destination. And I hear that the 14th floor is where you actually check in. Let's go. Oh, what's this artwork over here? Oh, we call the Shuhai. Shuhai, you know, okay. This is made by the Rotten. So they've got a very unique way of checking in at the lobby. You can actually sit down anywhere and they actually come and service you. So she told us this is one of the most Instagrammable flight of stairs. Yes. It's beautiful. Hi. hi. Is it like hi? hi. Yes, oh, sorry. Hi. No. Oh, really? <laughs> hi. It says hello to someone. It's a hi. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Also, it's on a high floor. Oh, it's on a high, high floor. Yes. Get it? Yeah. If you drink a lot, you go. You also get high. Oh my god. They're as punny as me. I love it. Look at this. Yes, I am having a cocktail made by the really cute bartender. He's not Phantom. He was here somewhere just now. But this is the most gorgeous seaside bar I have ever seen. I want to stay here forever. Like seriously, I already asked them for a booking for my birthday in December. You're invited. Oh my god, my entire orange peel went in. So the unique thing about the Rosewood Sanya is that Oh my god, I want to live here! Every room that you see faces the ocean. Look at this view. Seriously, it looks like the Maldives encapsulated in a hotel room. This is amazing! I mean seriously, do you see that room that we're in? Every guest room, they have a little snail over here. It's a reminder for for guests to slow down and breathe and soak in the beautiful atmosphere here. I was meant to be here. My lunch experience was awesome. Wow, it's a really huge place. I was seeking cherry item, the ingredient is actually house cured meats. That is my lunch cooking in there. It has to be Bruno, the restaurant manager, took really, really good care of us. Oh my gosh, I see the actual baked garlic in there. Look at that. Oh, I think I'm gonna take this and this is for the crew. Bye. And you know, it was absolutely delicious. Chicken creation oh. and the tau. You can choose your knife? You have so many tau, you don't have yen tau. It's okay, yen tau is not enough. Their seafood here is so fresh. That is a whole lobster! Like literally fresher than my face. No, I'm kidding. Oh my god, my friend got my mouth full. So halfway during lunch, I was rudely interrupted by the very charming Bruno with another clue. It's a lot of stuff, what's going on? And the clue was essentials. That's it? There's the ice cream here. This is essential. And I was like, oh, we're definitely going to the beach. We are on an island, right? Where are we? I have a feeling I know what we're going to do. Yes! Oh, no, we're going out to sea! Oh my god! We're gonna be princesses for the day because that's what the boat is called. Beautiful. I know I'm having a champagne in my hand right now, but please do not drink and drive your boat. I believe that the real captain is upstairs. I'm just gonna sit here and relax. The best seat in the house. We actually found out a lot of what you can do. They really cater to your luxurious needs. Okay guys, I've never seen a setup like this on a yacht before and I've made some new friends. Finally, I'm not alone! We were actually served amazing, incredible food and it was high tea as well. 
代客人出来，让人享受一种海上生活的一种非常好的一个载体，让他感受海上更好的生活。我们还有很多客人的话是非常喜欢海上的运动的，比如说海上的摩托艇、diving 啊、游泳啊，还有钓鱼。还有钓鱼。今天的 sashimi 是不是你们钓？<笑> They're so fun to hang out with, and the one thing that I really wish we tried was the luxury sports car experience. Regret not doing it. So unfortunately, because we were out for quite a long time today, I missed my own performance. The mermaid show is something that happens. I'm kidding. I have no idea how to be a mermaid. No grace at all. Oh my god! Is it a whale? I think the biggest attraction, and I mean that literally, is the beluga whale. Their names are Tina and Andy, and they're actually a couple. Look at this cutie! The question is, is this upside down or is this the right way? I think this is upside down, right? So we all knows how to do yoga. They're so well taken care of. And here's actually the bigger part of the aquarium, so we'll see what we can find. Huge. This thing is the shark egg. And these two little sharks, they're not even one month old yet. This is the baby tank! Guys, these fish are humongous. They're so big, you just want to hug them like a bolster to sleep. I don't think you can do that though. My very first thought of Sanya was that it's going to be the same thing again, right? But no, I was proven so wrong. It's fast developing to be one of the most like beautiful destinations for your next vacation in the world. There's something for everyone. And my conclusion is that anything that starts with an S and ends with an A is definitely awesome.